and welcome back to Press X for Chromosomes, where it's time to take Lev on the hotel journey. Yeah. Come on, kiddo. I want to get up there because this is where we're going. Wh why were you acting like you were injured for a second? What about that? Yep, I see yep. it. Cool. I already knew it was there. Jump and get it. Bring down a body with you. Lev, come get this down. Coming. I like how he put the bandages on over our thick ass coats. Jacket, yeah. <laughs> that makes no sense. Nice. Time to climb down. But what's up? <laughs> the ceiling. <laughs> God. Be careful. I like how it's doing the uh, you're being spotted noise. Yeah, I don't know why. I wish it didn't. But it's just like Abby being scared. Look at all these rooms that you just it's would fucking fall. Fucking maze. You would fall. In uh, control. <laughs> Literally. Ashtray maze. Yeah. Now we're down here, which definitely looks fucking full of happy things for us. Oh, yes. Remember when the Fedra agent was just like, oh, the nest was too big. What made you think coming down here was a good idea? I think it made me a mile away for fucking characters to drop, typically. Now what? Follow me. Play the current, be calm. Well, I'm shooting anything that's fucking in my way. I'm just telling you right fucking now. Fair enough. Because someone's going to probably come flying out of here. Oh, absolutely. This is going to be jump scare city of fucking... Yeah, you can just see, like, the form. It's probably a fucking stalker, but it's going to go after I grab this. Avery, the Black, the Black Ray Hotel contains a large group of infected, likely the ones that spilled out of the hospital. We need you to end your crew to bring down the supports from the inside out. Use the supply explosives and remote detonators. Good luck. But they'll survive in little nooks and crannies. Yeah. Don't be somebody. Cool. Thanks, bro, for not killing me. He's not done cooking yet. Yet. Yeah. Kill somebody else in the future. Yeah. Unless we bring down this building, but like you said, it's just gonna... A little far. Oh, hey. <laughs> there I am. Whoa, bye. Hey, stop it. Stop it. I will shake you to death. <laughs> Shaking baby syndrome. <laughs> I'm, gonna, gonna, I'm gonna name my flashlight brand fucking sh baby. <laughs> <laughs> and you have to shake it to turn it on. It's like those watches that are um, motion charged. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I, but also, like, I don't feel like my wrists move that much. So I feel like I'm just going to, like, start flailing my fucking I mean, wrist around. I you, like, swing your arm when you're walking. Nah. It doesn't sound real. Well, you lost your... That's what I was talking about, though. Right, yeah. But I didn't want to shoot Lev in the head with a fucking flaming shotgun yeah. around. Not that it would have actually hurt you, because you're fucking god. Yeah, invincible. Yeah, we, we hate them, too. Demons suck. Yeah. Uh, Tegan actually used to have one of those watches. Those gyroscope oh, yeah? watches, yeah. Or whatever the fuck they were. Does she have wrist problems? No, I mean, she just <laughs> walked a bunch. I just wanted to create a narrative that she had to shake it a bunch to even, like... like <laughs> She was using a shake weight. For. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, from what you were telling me, it's probably exactly what she was doing with it. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> like, that is a life I would never God. like to associate with I, ever again that's just the whole thing just like i too I like to live with danger i don't you right <laughs> just wake up in the morning if you have, if you really really gotta pee it's just fucking like extra difficulty <laughs> yeah um, i just uh, uh, like, like i was gonna say i don't give a flying fuck if you have sex i really don't just don't do it in the room next to me like be, bang just, against the wall be like you know professional about Curious. it like be yeah. courteous discreet yeah, like, if you're a screamer, go get a hotel room. Okay, also, you can just not scream. It's fucking doable. It's not that fucking hard to kind of muffle yourself a little. 
I wouldn't know. But it's, no, I know. It's, it's, it's really not that hard. It, that's why I just... It sounds like your sister just doesn't care. Oh, no, no, no. Tegan's not a screamer. Oh, okay. No, no, no. She is not a screamer. Um, a, my friend had a roommate who was a screamer, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. Fuck that. Like, yeah. she just didn't care. No. That's all that says to me. Well, I mean, she was... She was the one who would, like, scream at, like, the neighbor kids, like, the or when I say neighbor kids, like, the upstairs kids and that kind of stuff. Like, she was just full-blown insane. So, her being a screamer, when, like, when my friend was like, yeah, she's a screamer, I was like, why does that not surprise me? Okay, you are facing that way, sorry. No, you're good. You're being tactical. There's d- clickers are the last thing I want to deal with here. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, love. A little sweetheart. Nice and vicious. Just how I like him. Kid, you need to talk? <laughs> right? I can't dodge here. Explosives. Well, anyway. It really sucks not having a melee. Yeah. I'm sure I'll find something somewhere around, but I think I was running into this problem last time. I was like, oh, I don't have a thing on me. That's a joke. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn, kiddo. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks for that, back. Back up to three. I'm more comfortable on fucking my shotgun and like, ammo. It's just like you wanna, you wanna see nice stuff, and you know, be a little bit more at ease. Right. What, what do you mean? Because it's just like it's no longer like decre- like it's oh yeah this, this is kind of an okay floor yeah, yeah yeah I you know our hotel room was kind of this big I'm sorry. no it's okay my phone had it coming it's not like I'm using it right <laughs> now anyway legs. I'm sorry no that's okay like it's not like I'm fucking using it <laughs> so your room was that big at the hotel it was pretty big yeah but we also got like a fucking like sweet- oh yeah your cat's outside yeah my cat's outside I heard him let out one pitiful meow and I just didn't fucking acknowledge it <laughs> it was like. I was like, yeah, I know you're out there, <laughs> kitty. Yeah. He's but been out for two seconds. He can be out for a tiny bit longer. I well didn't we didn't he like make a noise on our first episode and then like Yeah, but whatever. Like he's still been out for like two, two seconds. Hours. Yeah. Not a big deal. Arr, that's how I feel about it. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna attack this drywall. Okay, yeah, so sweet. That's how big it was. Yeah, it was it, hmm. but it was like a king size sweet because fucking prices are cheap right well, yeah, now so we no, took might as well 100 percent. okay i didn't even get time yeah to shoot my gun i was rearing up and then he just fucking came at me bro jumped at him well i guess i should fucking heal just the top off yeah it's the whole it's attrition yeah i've actually thought about maybe um I don't know. It's pretty late in the season to go to Ocean Shores now, but oh yeah, I, I've thought about taking like a Friday off and just going somewhere just to, because I haven't. Man, just in six months, even getting just a hotel room for like a couple nights is yeah. really nice. It just gets I'm away. Sure. But I was gonna say you might feel a little sad about your dog and stuff. I do get. I don't know if it's like so much homesick as it's just like I just miss my dog. I miss my cat too when I go places. So I totally get it. Like, yeah. I just also, I'm like, I know that he's being taken care of and stuff. Right. And I'm going to be back. So that's my kind of right. thought process and on I mean, it. But I know he's too. a little bit more support for you. Yeah. Well, and like with him too, like he sleeps with me. Like, it's so hard for me to sleep without an animal. Like when we were in Japan, it was easy because the warmth and the pressure that Hamilton gives me Mm -hmm. was supplemented by you because you know we were sharing a bed yeah um but like when I'm just sleeping alone in a hotel room it's the hardest thing to do for me because I'm just so used to having a dog and two fucking cats snuggling up to me no that's that's completely fair and then you just be cold yeah like alone in your room 
I, but it is still nice. It's just sure. it's a change of pace. I'm sure I could probably find a dog friendly hotel too, and just bring Hamilton along. But then I'd the, have to like the one we went to was pet friendly. Yeah, the, I would just have to like make sure he doesn't scratch up anything. Yeah, and I mean, knowing Hamilton, he's a little shit. He probably would instantly. Yeah, yeah just be like, I can dig at the ground. I dig, I dig at the ground. I'd be like, No, Hamilton, stop. <laughs> but, like, <laughs> Put a dig at the ground. No, stop. Yeah, stop. Stop yeah, pawing at the ground. Eric and I made the joke when we went to the hotel where we were like, Dude, we could bring Avalon. I was like, Avalon. <laughs> not have a good time no. i'm just gonna tell you that right then cats that. do that not is, travel that is way as much as i'd love to just be able to take him places yeah not in the cards he just no. he gets to stay home and be comfortable yeah <laughs> fucking left bro <laughs> yeah stop doing this he's like so similarly colored to like the clicker or like the the he's beige he's the yeah. same color as everything in here i was gonna say this is like probably what capcom devs sleep in when they're making resident evil games <laughs> Just change out the bulbous parts for eyeballs. Yeah, exactly. Wait, I think I could have gone up more up there. I'm kidding. I'm coming back. There was, yeah, that. There was a across. side thing. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna walk normally, but Fine. I do think I ultimately just go down. Five Zambos come screaming out of the fucking. Wall. I remember a cheese something. It might have been down here. Mm -hmm. Um. I was under it's I'm up under like a slab I'm just crouched like this because that's the only way you can really travel that way and they couldn't get at you they couldn't get at me so nice. I was just sitting down there fucking unloading on them knees. just funneling them they couldn't get to me nice is absolutely a valid tactic yeah I was like it works apparently you can do that in Minecraft for like um Enderman oh yeah yeah you just Oh build. yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because they can't get at you because yeah. they're three blocks tall. They just will fucking vibrate at you. Mm -hmm. So it's a very <laughs> I like how you said that. You're like, mm hmm they totally vibrate at you. Oh yes, they do. <laughs> um But yeah, no, I I watched uh uh Oh hey. Yeah, I was, fuck, man. I watched a Let's Play channel do that and I was like, that's fucking smart, man. Why didn't I think of that? Yeah. That is smart. They're making so many changes to vanilla Minecraft though. Like there was I mean, it has a ton of shit still. Like, it keeps having a ton of shit. Yeah, they, they, and they're adding, like, um, they're changing up the cave system. They're improving it. So that way you actually get, like, caves and not, like, pockets of, like, earth being dug away. Oh, and yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, like, watching their update. And I was just like, oh, my God, this looks amazing. I also, I, like, I have a hard time with the cave systems in the first place because they just, oh, no, maybe I just stood on the other side of this. And just shot at them. Yeah. Come on. You're not doing it? Suspicious. Fine. You sus? You like that? I think they understand they can't get me. Oh, it's a shambler. Yeah. Nice. Now he's the fucking mini pieces of a shambler. And there's like dudes standing here. They're like, eh. they're like running around. I'm like, shut up! I see you. <laughs> you okay back there? Yeah. Yeah, I, I have a hard time with the case system because just everything looks the same. But I'm wondering what was with this. Seeing me. I was getting the noise. Hmm. Whatever. Not like they can come up here. Right. Um. But I'm wondering with this update if. They're going to make the caves a little bit more unique so you can kind of find your way out a lot easier. I just, they always turn to a massive chasm yes. and it's a fucking nightmare. And there's always like five. I get lost constantly. Yeah. So that's something like, I don't know. Oh, there's. I mean, there's a reason why I play Sky Factory instead of vanilla Minecraft right now. Yeah. Like I like, I want, I want to love vanilla Minecraft mm -hmm. and just. So sometimes just isn't in the cards for me. Right. Well, and I've had a hard time thinking about picking up Sky Factory again because oh, I, hate this. I had spent I don't know how many hours on one of my Sky Factory files and that just... And did you lose all of that? I didn't grab the game data because I couldn't figure out where it was put. Yeah. So I lost my Sky Factory file. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, I mean, you could probably still access it, right? No, the hard drive's wiped. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gone. It's absolutely That's gone. That's fair. 
So it'd be like that. Yeah. So it, it's basically just eh, whatever. Start up a new file. Build better. Do better. You know that kind of stuff. Yeah. But, well, now you know you can approach things slightly differently. The beginning grind of Sky Factory is just it ugh, sucks. Yeah. It's terrible. So it's just getting through that initial grind of that's somebody is absolutely combusting. Oh, absolutely. Out of there. Um, but it's, it's the beginning grind of like start getting the, the trees you want, start getting the planters, start doing this, start doing that. Like it's just yeah. right when you start backing away too. Yeah, you I was gonna say shitheads. Fucking programming. You fucking coward. Um, Fight me. I mean, I, it's smart though because it's just kind of like same, bro. Well, you're looking at it and then you're backing away, so clearly you don't think this is a threat anymore. This is a perfect opportunity to come fucking <laughs> scrambling at you. Yeah, you put down your gun. Now's the time. Exactly. But they are paper mache, so it's not yeah. that much. I like how all the doors are like broken out the same. I guess people being their way out. Or the uh, the spores on the um, window kind of remind me of that one art piece that was like a cherry blossom tree, and it was like really, really, really pretty. And then when you zoom in, it's a bunch of hands, handprints. Oh, do you yeah. remember that? And it was just like, it's like, yes, yeah, this is really creepy. This is really, really pretty. Oh, this is creepy. We've had that for the few things. <laughs> I've seen a lot of the art just in general too. Oh, okay. shit, that's just like. Well, when you zoom before you zoom in, like if you zoomed out, it looks great. And then right. as you look at the details, you're like, oh, wait a second. It was kind of like that one. It's a, it's a weird like juxtaposition like it's right. sweet but it's also not right it's like that one art piece that we saw at the um the asian art museum that was that beautiful like big old cloak oh yeah the, but it was the, the goddamn kimono yeah the yeah. dog tag kimono yeah yeah like it was really or cool whatever and then, the korean equivalent is of that because it was korea right I, I don't remember exactly what it was called but no that was really really cool and then it was just kind of like Oh, that's a little sad. Yeah, well, to be fair, the, behind that wasn't just people who had like lost their lives or anything. Right, they, it, was it was just people, people who had served. Yeah, yeah. they asked to donate their tags and stuff like that for that, which was so it was like cool, but also it was like a little bit because there were also ones who had died. Right. So there was a little bit of twinge of like, mm. but it wasn't all bad. Yeah, yeah. Give me my things faster. Can't you hear me fucking <laughs> slamming the button? Oh, I can. Um, Game can't. It's my favorite thing when I request a hotel room. Like, if I'm doing it online, and it's just like, put your remarks here. I always request, like, as low as to the floor as you can, please. Yeah, I kind of, I both don't care and care now. <laughs> like, I don't want to be high up, but if it's like a three-story floor, whatever. Oh, no, no, that part doesn't matter. I'm just like, anything above five, I start getting a little bit nervous. <laughs> yeah. Like double tree. Yeah. On the seventh floor. No, can I not be? <laughs> Please, can I change a room? Yeah. Or my favorite when I request a uh yeah, I think we're calm down. A no down pillow and they still give me downy pillows. And I'm just kinda like We've we've de we've definitely requested a few times, like no down pillows, mm -hmm. fucking uh room close to the ground mm -hmm. or whatever, and they just it's like those comments don't mean anything to right, them. No. And like I will immediately go to the front desk and be like, I requested cotton pillows because I am I, allergic I've, to down. Yeah, that's will, the thing that bogs my mind. If somebody's making a request, they're probably making it for a reason. Right. It's not don't, just to be a shithead. Yeah, don't fucking think that you know better right. for them. Like I will They could be have a severe allergy, honestly. Right. Like I will why would you not think about that? Literally wake up with a fever if i sleep with a down pillow yeah or a down comforter even yeah like i don't remember what it was i think it was with michaela so i was at one of the cons and the comforter had down in it and we didn't know but we had swapped out the pillow and woke up in the morning i was just feverish and i felt gross and all this kinds of stuff and michaela was like well we swapped out the pillow so she like pulls the comfort out of the duvet and looks mm -hmm. at it and it's down so we had to go get a uh cotton comfort yeah. from the front desk and we're just like it's it's an allergy we can't 
just leave it. Nice. I think I see a chamber down there. Bullshit. This is a bloater. This isn't even a fucking shambler. Oh. Okay, 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 hello, hello, I'm here. I killed it, but I'm not holding it anymore. And I'm getting fucking absolutely eviscerated. How did, did I win? six shots, shotgun shells? Bloaters are like the like mega bad ones though. Uh, fair. So that's I was gonna say I don't think we see any more bloaters, but Okay. <laughs> fucking I would have been a liar immediately. But see, I remembered what to do there. That's why I just fucking started hucking right. a lot of fucking I Because and that's why I was like, I know people come out of sides eventually, but they take a little while. And right. Clickers are stupid, so they'll go towards the sound first. But that one clicker that like came out into the hallway, it was like, well, the noise is from over there, but, but I look see this way you because I apparently that can see. Was bullshit. Yeah, that that's the kind of shit that I'm like, okay, well, that's bullshit. Yeah, like, they don't see. No, that's the whole thing about clickers. They don't see, so like, why can they kind of see me? The only thing I could think of was the light being on i guess to be fair i think i maybe have oh jesus yeah there's a lot of these guys around you're my hostage i thought these guys would have come out by now there'll be a couple more of those okay. so just get it. be aware fine kill i'm not being too haphazard just because the the main things are gone right. but and like you said, those guys are easy peasy. So exactly. I do but like yeah, the little writing desks that are in hotel rooms. They're nice. Yeah. Always kind of make me want to get one. Yeah. No. Sorry. But also, like, where would I put it? Yeah. Well, when I have my own place, I'll actually have a writing desk. I'll actually have a very like look at how established the, writing area. Look at how this is set up because I'm supposed to go through there and stuff like that. So they're expecting me to like immediately like sneak around. But here's the kicker: those stalker guys are fucking everywhere in the yeah, walls they would ruin and so it. they instantly ruin it yeah because i think like even over here you just walk in and they're just like hey uh, i hope you like fucking being stalked yeah it, it's the whole thing of like you want to do something cool but you gotta have the balance yeah and that's the thing it just becomes fucking okay i'm just gonna throw a bunch of molotovs or yeah. pipe bombs because Fucking nice. You make a no win situation for me. Right. It's unwinnable. This is the only way you Unless can I proceed. fucking run and gun. Who are you? Which kind of feels cheap in a game that you could be stealthy in in the first one. You did good. I mean, I might have killed everything since they were having a conversation. He didn't actually do anything. Yeah, you're just kind of there. I mean, if anything, the bloater knocked the clicker off of you. I was stuck in that. I'm surprised I made it out of that, actually. I'm so glad you made it out of that. I was stuck in a fucking vicious cycle of yeah. pummeling. And, it, it, like, at one point, I w was killing a clicker, but it wasn't in my hands. It was right, just dying yeah, yeah. off screen. <laughs> and then, like, another point, fucking, the, the bloater was just fucking, like, Donkey I'm Kong here. punching me with yeah. both arms. <laughs> And like trying to rip my jaw out, and I'm just like still killing the clicker. Okay, yeah. I think we got it all, kid. Time to go Let's here. Go. I see, like, this is the thing. Like, I'd be like, there's a bunch of zombies coming after you, and it's like, nope, not really. Yeah. Like, why would I even? I just killed them all because it's a fucking nightmare otherwise. Right. Fuck this building. Agreed. Oh. Spear now. Well, it has Daddy more Daddy. uses. That's why Ooh, I just right, abandoned yeah. that. <laughs> Going through! Guys. Going through! I fucking hate elevators! Yup. Food! <laughs> Scree! A quarter. A quarter of a 
support her is what? <laughs> what? Old money? Old world money that you will never need. It's yeah. used in one of those machines that just broke. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on. I'm too full and everything. The other shit looked like fucking chalk and ammo, but I guess not. I don't know if it let you target it. Because it's definitely... No, oh, it's... rifle. Fucking Resident Evil in this game need to, you know, figure out what their ammo colors are and sync up. <laughs> right. peek through well this might be a good place to stop i feel like this is gonna be obviously oh this is definitely a room of no return yeah Yeah. so well i fuck it all right let's let's go through hey we're back out you can take off your mask you can take your mask as far as you think fucking guy like melting over here or something i mean Spores can exist outside. Maybe not like in a, a windy area like this, but. Yeah. That's why I was like, I don't know. Like, I feel like you'd still. Just in case. Yeah, I would wait until you're definitely clear of shit. Because, oh, like I said, absolutely. turns to the left, guy fucking molding out. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It's right there. It's right there. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. I almost died a thousand times. Jesus, kid. What an adventure. Yeah. But good place to stop. So we'll catch you guys on the next episode of We Enter the Hospital. Yo. So until next time. Bye.